Hi, everyone. I'm going to show you one of our newest feature releases, which will improve the way you search, edit, and maintain your content across all of your translation memories. And all we have to do to get started is jump into the phrase TMS. So you want to navigate to the translation memory option on the side panel. And here you can see the brand new translation memory list page. In the previous TM search function within the phrase TMS, users could only edit one translation memory at a time, which was really time consuming and not efficient. So with this new search function, we hope that even our users with hundreds or thousands of TMs can better maintain and edit their translation memories. So let's see how that's done. First of all, you can see the new translation memory list page here, and you can adjust how you view the page. So you can see how many translation memories you have here and the pagination at the bottom. You can also adjust the properties so you can see all of your translation memory info in one window. So if you have a client specified or a domain, you can add that here. So let's search within our TMs. You can select your TMs to search through ones that you specifically want to look through and then clicking the search TM content and you can see that they are pre-populated here. Or you can search all of them at once by leaving them all unticked and searching the content. So you can search in the source language or the target language. And you can also use the fields down here to even further specify what you're looking for. So I'm going to search first for a word in English. And I'm going to search the target text. And I can use these options here to further specify if it contains, does not contain, or is. You can use the match case or use regular expression, which is a new and improved feature here. You were not able to do this before in our translation memory search. And finally, you can add filters. So if you know the exact project or file, who it was created by, you can narrow down your search even more. But I'm just going to stick with these search results here. And you can see that I brought one translation memory up and three items. So here I can edit the source or the target language by double clicking. And here I will enter my preferred term. and save. And then the entry disappears because it no longer matches our search results. You can see the context panel on the right hand side here, which shows you which TM it was found in, who was created by, last modified, and the previous and next segment, which is really important to get the context of the segment that you're currently editing. And you can see the context for the source and the target language. When I'm all done and I've adjusted everything I want to, I can go back to the search results and either adjust or start a new search. That's all for now with for this new feature. It's available for ultimate and enterprise customers in the admin and project manager roles. So we hope that this makes your translation memory search and upkeep much easier and faster. If you have any questions at all, feel free to reach out.